In today's video, we find out if the brand new set at pre-sale price can beat the legendary Rarity Collection 2. What's up guys, we're back with another epic battle video, including the new set, which comes out the day you're seeing this, it should be out uh, to everybody at TCG player, at your local stores and everything. But the prices on the screen will be pre-sale because it was edited yesterday. So it gives it a fighting chance against the legendary Rarity Collection too. This should be a pretty fun battle because Rarity Collection has some crazy cards inside. You pull a lot of value. Battles of Legend, not so much unless you get a really nice card. So let's see if we can do that. Before we do that, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards, Uriah, Ravi, and Haman, Lord of Striking Thunder. These are from the Mega 10 2021. Just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below which will win. Will it be pre sale Battles of Legend Terminal Revenge or Ready Collection 2? All right, let's crack these things open and get to it. We still have um, not pulled the big card out of uh, Terminal Revenge yet. We've only opened a couple of packs. We had that chatty video yesterday, and then we opened a couple boxes on Wednesday, but tomorrow, Saturday, we will be opening a ton of packs. It's gonna be pretty insane. So make sure you guys are there for that. It's gonna be crazy. We're gonna be opening to get the legendary Dragon Master Magia, which will be pretty amazing because that card is really awesome looking. You can see it on the cover. Really cool, iconic monster. And if we do get it, it's going to be pretty awesome. So I'm hoping tomorrow we can get it. We have a lot of cases to open. All right, let's start the battle and see who can win. Battles of Legend. Here we go. Two from the back. We have the Gen X Power Planner, Freezing Chains, Electro Blaster, Gen X Ally Birdman, and a Secret Rare Void Imagination. Very cool. Next pack, there are a couple extra Battles of Legend Terminal Revenge. So we'll do a couple in a row to start. Uh, Ritual Beast Tamer Winda, Sprite Jet, Toy Tank. Guard Dog and Ice Jade. Give me your Ice Green. A Green. Rarity Collection 2. Can we pull something big? One from the back is the correct back trick. You can pull a lot of different cards in here. Raikou is really cool. Hieratic Seal. Gold Sark. Primitive Planet Reich Phobia. The Hieratic Seal of the Heavenly Spheres. Forbidden Lance. Unchained Soul of Rage. The Fantastical Dragon Phantasme. And a Platinum Rare Exo Sisters packs. That's a nice card. We'll take that. So we're already starting it off nice with the Rarity Collection, too. We've got a couple of nice cards. The uh, Platinum Rares aren't crazy expensive, though. So it's not going to like win the battle right off the bat. But that is something. Let's see how Terminal Revenge can hold up on the next pack. We have Ritual Beast, the uh, General Wayne, White Circle Reef, Bunch of Beasts, and the End of Anubis Secret. The Ancient Sanctuary Secret Reprint. Interesting. That's very interesting, actually. So we'll take that. Back to Rarity 2. This should be a very shiny opening because it's all shiny cardboard. Let's see if we can get something big in both of these packs. Psychic and Punisher, DD Crow, classic. Rescue Rabbit, Abyss Dweller. That is a Prismatic Ultimate Rare. Very nice. The Super Nibble Mega Hamster, Collector Rare for... The uh, Edison Dex, Fantastical Dragon Phantasme, Chimera, Pot of Duality, and Abominations Prison. So Rarity 2 is already feeling pretty strong. A lot of nice cards so far. We'll see if we can keep that up as we go. It's probably going to keep up because it's Rarity 2. So what Battles Legend Terminal Revenge needs to do. Oh, Mirror Jade's in here? Interesting. Is pick it up. Singingen and Gorgias, Swordsman of the Ice Barrier. Two in a row for luck. Send us some luck right now, guys. Make sure you guys come out for the live stream tomorrow on YouTube. It's going to be really fun. We're going to be opening a lot of packs. Division, we have Arbitrator of White and Arms of Gen X Return Zero. Secret Rare. Rarity 2, back at it. Here we go. Can we pull something big? One, two, three, four. Oh, we don't do four. We do three, right? Okay. Book of Eclipse, we have Droll and Lockbird, Exo Sisters Magnifica, Bingo Machine Go. Abomination's Prison, Ghost Mourner, Silent Swordsman, Solemn Judgment, Platinum Rare, and a Luber, Jesper of Jester of Despia. All right, next pack, let's go to Terminal Revenge again. Can we pull something epic? Two from the back. We have Brandon Lost, Infernoid, Frozen, Earthbound, and Full Armored Utopic, Ray Lancer, Secret Rare. Back-to-back -back Battles of Legend. I think we're catching up in terms of number of packs left. We have the uh, Ritual Beast Ulti Archipelio Burst uh, White and the Shining Star Dragon. Interesting. Is it like a 5Ds thing? Shining Star Dragon. Kind of cool. I kind of like that. Okay, back to Rarity Collection 2. So far, Rarity Collection has performed pretty well. Had a lot of good pulls. Trap Trick Reflecia, Rescue Cat, Twin Twisters, Polymerization, Rux Special. Uh, almost Rux. I almost just pulled all the cards. Opelosa, 
Fusion deployment. And a brick. Whoa, okay. That's going to probably win it for him. IP Masquerainer, quarter century secret rare, alternate art. That is probably all it takes to win. That is going to be money right there. That, that We're going to need to pull the Phantom of You Bell. We're going to need to pull a big Q QCR. That's big. That's one of the best cards in the set. Okay. Okay. Rarity Collection 2 back at it. It's going to be hard for Terminal Revenge to come back. Look, Rarity Collection is so good. It's beating pre sale prices right now, which is pretty wild. Uh, they're definitely winning now after that. Uh, Gen X controller and, ooh, the legendary Exodia Incarnate. And by winning, I mean ahead right now. I don't know if they're necessarily going to win or not. One more of these. Exodia Incarnate's really cool. Very cool. Two from the back. We have the, uh, Infernoid Piate. Ice Barrier, Life Pack. All right, Gen X Undyne. And Grogonol, the Dusk Dragon. This was in, uh, Photon Hypernova, I think, maybe. I think it has a Starlight Rare Print. And Rarity, we've already pulled IP Masquerina. It's going to be pretty tough to beat that. That's really nice. One from the back. Uh, we have the Ultimate Slayer, Access Code Talker, Pot of Duality, Crystal Wing Synchro, Rux and Special, Solemn Judgment. And that is a regular Ultra. Okay. Control Lockbird Alternate Art, Enemy Controller Secrets for Ben Lance. So that's our first dud from Rarity right there. Back to Terminal Revenge. Pretty good opening so far. I mean, IP Masquerina, you can't complain anytime you pull that alternate art. Gen X Ally, Birdman, Horror, Void Breach, Synchro Panic, and the Infernoid Decathlon. One more and I think we'll be caught up. I think we'll be basically even here. Basically even on the packs. What will we have here? We have the Medallion, the Hexa Spirit, RX, or our Gen X Turing, and the Infernoid Hermaeus, I think that might have been Infernoids were like in 2015. They were kind of popular, I think, or like they're printing a lot of them, stuff like that. Still a lot of packs left. Still a lot of packs left. We have the Aluber, MST, Rescue Cat, Didi Crow, Cosmic Cyclone, Masquerade, Raikou, Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, the Twin Twisters, and that is it. That's everything. All right, Rarity. Couple, couple duds in a row for Rarity, but they already pulled IP, so they're kind of just chilling. They're just like, eh, whatever. They're up by 30. They're just letting them make a few shots. Bunch, we have a Toy Box and the Gorgias. Not really making much for the uh, Terminal Revenge. They've been kind of slacking off. I'm not going to lie. Slacking off. Let's see what Rarity can do. Uh oh, I see something shiny. We have Dark Dragoon, Designator, Magician Souls, Gold Sark. Underworld Goddess, Skill Drain, Cosmic Cyclone, and the Rescue Rabbit QCR. Another QCR. That's two straight, uh, the big hits being QCR, so that's pretty good. Rescue Rabbit's not a crazy one or anything, so that's not going to like end their hopes for Terminal Revenge. They need a Phantom of You Bell, though, like big time. Uh, and Sky Star Grace. I'm assuming Phantom of You Bell has a QCR, but... I don't, I don't think it's actually confirmed yet, is it? Because it isn't on the price guide. Or else it's one of those ones on the price guide where they don't have the... It's like priced at zero, so it doesn't pop up at the top. Uh, Solid Magician, MST, cross out Designator, Droll and Lockbird. Whoa, whoa, okay. Prismatic Ultimate Rare. The Planet, not a big one. Uh, Souls and XC's Encore. Some of those Planet ones are decent, but they're not like crazy big or anything. But they will add up to the score. You know, it's going to help. Two from the back. General Wayne, let's see what we can get here. Terminal Revenge, bunch of bodies, and the Ace of Spades, Speculation. All right, still a lot of packs left. Still a lot of chances for us to pull something crazy. Rarity, I did two. I didn't even, didn't mean to do two, but it's fine. Magnifica, Pax, Ruxin Special, Plast the Rescue Cat, Collector Rare. I missed a lot of Collector Rares while we were doing the big opening because they're very easy to Ruxin Special. Masquerade, Sound Swordsman, and the Pearly Pretty Memory. Let's get some big for Terminal Revenge right here. Two from the back, we have the Sprite Red, Ritual Beast Ambush, Electrode, Singagen, and Full Armored Utopic Ray Lancer. That is not something big. Okay, nine packs left of each. Rarity Collection with a significant lead thanks to a massive QCR pull. It's going to be hard to beat that on either side. Bingo, we have the Exosister Packs, Pot of Duality, Skullmeister, Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, the Enemy Controller, Prismatic Ultimate Rare, the Psychic and Punisher, Prismatic Collector Rare, Rescue Cats, and the DD Crow. Oof, Battles of Legend, back at it. Terminal Revenge, two from the back. Sprite Red, Gen X Power Planner, Guard Dog, Tori box. We have the spiritual beast tamer, Lara, secret rare. Okay, still a bunch of packs left. I think it's eight each, so 16 total packs in this opening. One from the back for rarity collection two, blue eye spirit dragon, cosmic cyclone, charger light brigade, primeval planet, pearlino, coral dragon. 
Ghost Mourner, Moonlit Shell, XC's Encore, Pot of Duality, and another IP Mascarena. This is the Platinum Secret Rare version. So we have both the QCR and the Platinum version of the alternate art. That is going to be hard to beat. I mean, Platinum's probably going to be like 10 bucks. I think the QCR was like 60 something last I checked. So, I mean, Phantom View Bell, I think, is like 60 in pre sale. So that's that could tie it up. The problem is, I'm not sure how many money cards they've had in general on Battles of Legend. But the thing with pre sales, a lot of times they can be a few bucks and they end up being like 10 cents. So maybe that's out. Oh, Sprite Sprint is in here. So like all the sprites are in here. That's crazy. Electrode and the Infernoid Armadier. We need something better. Rarity Collection 2. Uh, you, you can chill out a little bit, Rarity Collection 2, so we can come back. We have Diddy Crow, Crossout Designator, Preparation of Rights, Rescue Cat, Droll and Lockbird, Guardian Chimera, Magician Souls, and Peaceful Planet Calarium. That was a dud. That's what we need to have a chance to come back, Terminal Revenge fans. Here we go in the comments. Send some luck for Terminal Revenge. Let us pull something big, life hack, and the Red Lotus King Flame Crime. Okay, that's that's quite the name right there. And it, the, the score is on the screen, and it feels like it might be a beatdown. I'm not gonna lie, it feels like it might be a beatdown. I don't know for sure though, because pre pre-sale does have it's very powerful. Do not underestimate the pre-sale. Uh, Silent Magician. Okay, Trap Church for Felicia. Oh, another QCR Chaos Hunter, and Masquerade the Blazing Dragon Chaos Hunter. Definitely not a big QCR, so that's not terrible for Terminal Revenge. We can handle a Chaos Hunter, that is for sure. Okay, uh, Terminal Revenge, two from the back. We have Springen's Kits, Sprite Pixies, Electrode, Division, and another Gorgas Swordsman of the Ice Barrier. We've pulled that guy quite a bit. Nothing really big, nothing really big so far out of Terminal Revenge, it feels like. We got Masquerade, we got Underworld Goddess, Rescue Cat, Book of Moon. Okay, we see something shiny on the edge. Will it probably Platinum, I would guess, but it could be QCR. Platinum number 60, okay. And uh, Super Nimble Mega Hamster, School for Edison. Just adding to the score while we are sitting here with Terminal Revenge, just doing nothing. Two from the back. Bright Pixies, come on. Gen X Ally, Gathering Light, we have our Gen X Turing, and Tri Brigade. I remember this card. This is in the structure deck, I think. Wasn't this in the structure deck? Or I thought this was in the uh, Albaz structure deck, wasn't it? I don't know. I could be wrong on that. I thought it was like a super rare in there. Not sure, though. Okay. Four of each left. Four of each left. Rarity collection. Please calm down. Solemn warning. Access code. Solemn strike. I see something shiny again. The Phantom Knights. Uh-oh. Droll and Lockbird. That could have been it. Prismatic ultimate rare. That's, in a good, that's a really good card. Red Eye Star Dragoon collector rare. Okay. Borland Dragon. It didn't calm down at all. That was a really good pack. Those were both great cards. That's going to make it even harder to come back. Because Red Eyes and, uh, and the Droll were both pretty strong early on in that set's life. So I'm guessing they still are. Synchro Panic. Gen X Controller. Urukari Demon Karte didn't have a Starlight reprint at some point. I don't remember what set it was, though. Here we go. One, two, three. Wait, what am I opening? Rarity, let's do one. Okay, Bingo Machine Go. Opelousa. I haven't gotten that in QCR. It'd be nice. Anti-Spell. I mean, I have. We've gotten everything, but <laughs> we opened every pack. We, we had the full set. Go check it out if you have, if you missed it. Fusion Deployment and Opelousa again in Secret Rare. You can watch the live stream where we pulled them all, or you can watch the binder where we uh, showed off them all. Okay, two from the back. Scrap Goblin, uh, Ritual Beast, Electro Blaster, Beast Cashin, and the Ritual Beast Inheritance Secret Rare. Rarity Collection up next. Come on. One, two, three, one. I keep wanting to do four, and it's just one. We have a Dark Dragoon, Twin Twisters, IP Mask, Arena, and Ultra Rare. We have almost all of them. A Luber, Psychic and Punisher, Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, and another QCR. Seas Encore. Okay, probably not a huge one, but, you know, it's a QCR. That's the fourth QCR of the box so far. Pretty good. Terminal Revenge, you're gonna need something, like need something big. We have the Infernoi, come on. The uh, Botox. This is a fusion of Frenzy Panda and Ryukishin. That is so awesome and classic. Sacrifice level up, we have Guard Dog and Wing Karibo level six, secret rare. Two left, Rarity Collection one. One more chance for Rarity Collection uh, two, I mean, not one. What in the world is this? Got like a splotch on it. That's weird. It's like a foil splotch that got dripped on there. That's like an error card. That's cool. Number 60, Preparation of Rights, Rux is special. IP Masquerina, Prismatic Ultimate. Why not? We've gotten the Platinum, we've gotten the QCR, and now the Prismatic Ultimate. The only high rarity one we didn't get was the Collector Rare. And then we, I'm sure we got the low end ones. We definitely got the Ultra Rare. We just pulled it. Ghost Mortar Collector Rare. This has been quite the rarity collection. Two openings. Sarabas. Yeah, this is going to be tough. It's going to be tough to beat. Leave me some one last pack. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you want to see us pull the main card tomorrow, go check out the live stream. It's going to be a long stream starting tomorrow around noon. Make sure you guys uh, you follow, subscribe, You know, turn on notifications so you know when it is. It's noon central, so it should be really fun. should be awesome. Hope to see you guys there. Last pack magic. Send some luck in the comments. Here we go. 
We have Medallion, Scrap Goblin, White Circle, Light Pack, and Infernoid Evil. I still have not pulled a QCR out of this set. So tomorrow we have our work cut out for us. That's for sure. Shout out to Toll Info Show, Nesto Deanna, American Deutscher, KK Beats, Brandon Cheney, Ian Musa Jr., Barding, Robert F. Changeling, and Adelso Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.